Hello guys, welcome back to the Civil Engineering YouTube channel. Please subscribe our channel for daily civil engineering videos. In today's lecture, we are going to solve a numerical problems of the soil mechanics subject. So here the problem states that the moist unit weight of a soil sample is 19.2 kN per cubic meter. And it is also given that the specific gravity is 2.69 and the water content of this soil sample is 9.8%. And we have to find out the first of all the dry unit weight, wide ratio, and the porosity, and the degree of saturation for this soil sample. So, starting with the solution of this for this problem, the given data for this soil sample is the unit weight. The moist unit weight is 19.2 kilonewton per cubic meter for this soil sample. The gravity, the specific gravity represented by GS is 2.69 and the water content is 9.8 percent if we change this to decimal so 9.8 divided by 100 so we'll get 0 0.098 here so starting now with the first unknown the dry unit weight the dry unit weight first to find out the dry unit weight for this soil sample so it can be found out by this formula which is the most commonly used formula in the soil mechanics subject it is gamma d is equal to gamma divided by 1 plus w where gamma here is the moist unit weight of the soil sample and w here is a water content in the decimal unit so the gamma is the moist unit weight of the soil sample is known to us which is 19.2 here Dividing by 1 plus W, W here is 9.8 percent or 0.098. So here we will get our gamma D for this cell simple, the dry unit weight, which comes out to be 17.5 kN per cubic meter. So this is the first unknown, the dry unit weight of the this cell simple. The second is the wide ratio. So to find out the y ratio E, so for this we can use another formula of the dry unit weight that gamma D is equal to the GS specific gravity into the unit weight of water divided by 1 plus E. Now the dry unit weight is known to us, the GS is given to us 2.69, E is unknown to us and gamma W is also known to us which is the unit weight of the water and it should be kept in mind that the unit weight of the water is standard and it is 9.8 kN per cubic meter. You should remember this value by heart. It is the standard unit weight, the, uh, the unit weight of the water. So now if we put all this value here and we put this terms here on the left side, so it will become 1 plus E equal to the GS gamma W dividing by RD. I just shift these two terms with RD with 1 plus E. Now here if I put the values here, so this will become E will become GS gamma W divided by gamma D minus 1. So now by putting the value G is 2.69, gamma W is 9.81 dividing by 17.5 minus 1. So E comes out to be 0 0.51. So this is the wide ratio for this soil sample the third one is the porosity so porosity is very easy to find out because the porosity in the wide ratio is a relation which is e divided by 1 plus e so putting here the value here so n will be equal to the e is 0 0.5 1 divided by 1 plus 0 0.51 so we got here the porosity for this soil sample is 0 0.338 now the last term is the unknown is degree of saturation for this soil sample so again it's easy to find out we know that saturation is equal to the w which is the water content into gs divided by e this is the formula used to find out the degree of saturation here the water content is known to us which is 9.8 percent or 0 0.098 gs is a specific gravity known to us in e we find out 0 0.51 so Again, putting the value, so 9.8 is the unit weight 
of the is not the vinegar but it's the uh, moisture the content so water content so here it is 0.098 multiplying it with the gs which is 2.69 dividing by e which is 0.51 multiplying it with the 100 percent because degree saturation is always expressed in percentage so we got here 51.7 percentage this is the degree of saturation for this soil simple having the water content of 9.8 percent specific gravity of 2.69 and the the unit weight of the moisture unit weight of 19.2 kilonewton per cubic meter so hope you guys understand how to find out the different terms in for this soil sample and don't forget to subscribe our channel for daily civil engineering videos thank you for watching our video